New Brunswick Capital is Mike and Paul from the band Sandbox. Guys, welcome back to Fredericton. Great to have you back here. Thanks. Now you have a great new album out, which is Murder in the Glee Club, I guess, which is somewhat of a, a concept album. Yeah. Now how did that come about? Um, it, it was basically uh, like we, you know, we knew how many CDs were getting released at the time ours was and how, much, how many get released, you know, in general. And we just wanted to do something uh, to try to set ours apart from, you know, the thousands of others that come out at that time. So, mm -hmm. uh, you know, that's basically where the whole, the whole thing started from. Now, are you a fan of murder mysteries, or how did the murder concept come into it? Uh, we actually had the, the intro song uh, called The Murder in the Glee Club. It was, it was from a, a play. It was recorded about six years ago or something. Mm -hmm. It was recorded as an intro to a play, so we thought that would be a, a cool way to start the CD off, so everything kind of evolved from that, like the song. We had that song first, and we just based it around that. I should mention this whole idea came after the songs were recorded and sequenced, so, I mean, it was just something, like Mike said, just to separate it. I mean, mm -hmm. it wasn't, the songs were written with the intention of making a concept album. Okay. So when you perform this material live, is the songs broken up throughout the set, or is yeah, it intact? Yeah, yeah, we, uh, we don't tie them together. We just basically mm -hmm. do them differently every night. Okay. Now, how is the new, mater new material going over live? Yeah, it's going over well. Yeah, people are really responding well to the new stuff. So, I mean, you know, it's all pretty new for us. We haven't really, mm -hmm. haven't played that much of the new stuff yet, but... You know, we're, we're pretty excited to start mm -hmm. touring again and uh, give her our best shot. Now, this is your first uh, album being signed directly to a major label, EMI. Do you feel pressured now for the album to succeed? Not really. I mean, we never really put pressure on ourselves. It's just, you know, we're just some friends that got together and, you know, wanted to make music together. So we, mm -hmm. uh, you know, no pressure at all. Mm -hmm. You guys spend a lot of time touring. How does that affect your personal life? Do you, do you like touring or? Um, I don't. Mm -hmm. I don't mind touring. You know, if you go away for you know like two months, I think that's that's long enough. I wouldn't want to do it any longer than that. But mm -hmm. I mean, if it was up to me, I'd maybe do three weeks on and then take some time off. That way, you're not away from home for for too long of a period of time. Because a lot of bands, when you mention personal life, they say, "What personal life? I, I well, don't have yeah, one." yeah, that's that's pretty much it. But mm -hmm. you know, you have to try. Okay. I was also reading one summer you guys did a tour, and I guess your accommodation costs were about 300 bucks. Yeah. Now, how did you manage that? We uh, did the entire tour, two months, and we uh, we stayed. We took a tent actually. The record mm -hmm. company bought us a tent. We took that, and yeah, like we stayed in campgrounds 99% of the time. I think we only had like one or two hotels on the whole two month tour. I think the only time we did stay was a lightning storm. We had to we had to get a hotel room. <laughs> well, we'd sleep in a van like some bands yeah, have yeah, done. Yeah, exactly. We've done that too, though. <laughs> Slept in a van in Texas actually, mm -hmm. a parking lot at a hotel. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Now, on your last uh, album, you had a top ten video, Much Music Curious. Yeah. Now, how is Much Music giving you much airplay with the new video? Yeah, yeah, they've uh, they've responded well to it. They, uh, it hasn't hit the countdown yet, but uh, no, it's getting played. You know, once or twice a day, which is good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Two guitar players, Mike and Jason. Uh, however, there's no really big sounding guitar sound on the album. You focus more on melody and song structure. Yeah, I think. Um, I think melody, you know, is is the first and foremost thing we concentrate on. And the the producer we use, Don Fleming, um, he, he is a guitar-based guy, but he had a lot to do with you know the sound of the record mm -hmm. not being, you know, he he kind of wanted it, and we also kind of wanted it not to be a big, you know, too much of a guitar-driven thing, mm -hmm. so that it you know so there's more of a more of a melody, uh, more of a concentration on the melody. Mm -hmm. Now, what made you choose him for a producer? Because I know he's produced bands like Sonic Youth, I believe, and others. Yeah, he uh, uh, he did an album called Frosting on the Beater by a band called The Posies, mm -hmm. and that was a that was one that everybody in the band was a big fan of. And so that's how we got interested in him. And, and once we sent him the, the demos and stuff, he was really into the music and stuff. And he mm -hmm. just seemed like the right guy, and it worked out well. Okay. Now, I've seen your album, uh, albums, I guess, classified under alternative. I've seen them classified under pop. How would you guys categorize yourselves? I really don't like to categorize ourselves if, if I don't have to. I mean, I just let other people do it for us. Mm -hmm. Okay. Great. Yeah. And you're still based your band out of Nova Scotia. You haven't moved to Toronto anywhere? Yeah, we all live in Halifax right now. That's yeah. great, because a lot of bands now are moving. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't think there's any reason to move. I mean, I think once a band starts touring, you just... You start in one, you know, one side of the country, and you try and make it to the other side. I mean, that's you can live wherever you want. Okay. You can seek them if you feel like mm -hmm. it. 
Well, this is a great album. Thank you. I definitely wish you guys the best of luck. Thanks very much. Sandbox, Murder in the Glee Club.